please subscribe to my channel and click that bell icon so you don't miss out those videos thank you how's it going guys welcome to another video of real sim gaming in today's video i've been requested to add a vertical exhaust to this currently set to horizontal exhaust to this massive Ferguson, and i thought not and i thought why not make a video on it and i thought why not make a video on it and so you can do that later on on whatever model you like this is a simple method i wanted to share with you please if you did not subscribe to my channel subscribe for more let's start our tutorial so you need another mod for that so you can copy its vertical exhaust to this one and i'll show you how to transport from one i3d to an other i3d some parts of your tractor or whatever machine is that it is so simple follow all the steps first of all we need to extract that vertical exhaust from another tractor Lucky I have one and I will put the link in the description for that mod if you want to download that as well. That is Massive Ferguson 365. We'll just extract it and then open up its i3d file. And then select that exhaust so we can extract it. You have to find its place where it is located and then you can extract it here you can see we have that vertical exhaust so let's extract it quickly click on export selection with files select export selection with files and then give it a name I will add And then select the directory of your tractor or more folder where you want it to install. Select textures, open and then save it. I will set it to no. And now you can close that one. We don't need any more. Now I want to save it. Now go to where you have extracted it. We'll go to our mod folder and then go to textures. And here we can see we have vertical exhaust. Select it and then open up your previous i3d of where you want to install it. Now as you can see it is here but it, but it won't work just like that. We have to uninstall the first one and do some tweaks. So now press ctrl x that will surely cut it and then select this one and paste it. Now we will delete the older one. Press delete. It is gone forever. Our new exhaust is installed. Now we have to set its exhaust particles. And for this we have to go to exhaust particles. And then select that and put it to the new exhaust location. Now select so you have to make sure the first one exhaust particles have to set on the top of the tractor tractor body make sure it is centered and then select the other one I'm always bad at this I hope you will do it better now select the exhaust particles one and that green arrow shows us where the exhaust particles will leave from that exhaust I hope that makes sense this is where we see smoke coming out and then we will the blue arrow should be facing down
Now we will set it a little bit upwards so we can see the particles coming out from there. That looks uh, almost real. And I made some other videos on farming simulator tutorials. You can check them out. They are pretty much interesting and might come handy for you. So now what we have to do is select this index pause and go back to the folder. Select massive question 390. Search for exhaust and then paste that what you have copied from the main directory of the index path. Now paste it, save it, close that and reset camera. Now you can close these. And save it. Now select all files, add to RAR, zip, save it, select that, copy it and then move to your mods folder. I will delete the older one, paste the new one and now we will see it in the game how it looks. So we're back in the game and now we have to just buy that tractor and as you can see we have successfully installed our exhaust let's buy it and see how it works and looks here we are our mod is fine we can see exhaust i have another video that you can change the exhaust color to black that is a little bit of demonstration I've shown you in with this video you can easily detach some parts from another mode and bring it back to where to do one pin spot. That with this video you can take or give some parts from other mods. I hope you like it. If you did not subscribe, please subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Have a good one.